till now we have already discussed about in stream and important operations around it now let us discuss around how do we convert in stream into double stream and long stream okay so in this example we are going to discuss around that so let's say we have an array of integers numbers and its values are 1 2 3 4 5 now let's convert this into a in stream so for to convert in into in stream we have this in stream dot of we can pass the array elements now let's say we want to convert them into an stream of strings right so basically for that we don't have any uh, ready made method map to string rather we have map to object any type of object right so here what we want to do, uh, do uh, we will take the individual elements and we will just append with a empty space or a string right now this should be a so now we have converted this into stream of string now let us print them so system dot out print now if i save and run this now the elements are printed and they are all strings because you, you can also see here initially it was in stream the way we created using this in stream dot of but here it has got converted into stream of strings right and that was the objective of map to object now let us convert into map to uh, let us map to a double so basically we want to create a double stream all right so for that we can go ahead with in stream dot of numbers and then map to double map to double and then we can do individual elements we can like do any operation here so let's say square of it num into num or, or let's say you know square root of it so it will be math dot sqrt and we are passing all the individual elements then let's use for each and print them system dot out print so if i save and run this again uh, it's going in the same line so for that we can get rid using this now it will just put a, a point you uh, know cursor to the next line so let me run it again so now we are getting the square root of all these elements all these elements these are the square root values so now you can notice here is in stream initially has got converted into a double stream all right now let's convert in stream into a long stream so for that in stream dot of numbers dot map to long and now what we can do let's say square of it num into num so basically this method is going to convert you know into a long stream dot for each and inside the for each we can write this all right so let me put this also line separator sort of thing so that our output will be more cleaner let me save and run now you can see all these elements have got squared up right and also you can see in stream has got converted into a long stream so here what we have seen is we can have a in stream but we can transform into some other stream also you know depending on what element it contains okay so this concludes our numeric stream uh, you know topic and i hope you understood you enjoyed uh, you can always go to the documentation of you know oracle documentation about this in stream long stream and double stream and you can go ahead and you know see what's the methods inside and uh, you know use them most of the methods which are important i'll be i have already covered and also since it is part of the stream you can see this interface stream extends base stream okay and this base stream extends auto closable right so lot of methods are coming from the base stream itself that's why you can see this map filter and peak and all that okay skip limit okay 
so i hope this was a uh, understandable session for you if not then put your doubts in the comment or drop me an email okay